It's high time you spent high noon with the verse-spitting, six-shooting Western classic bringing faith to firepower. It's Mission Remap. In the world of Judge Dredd, the cursed earth is a radiation-blasted wasteland spanning what was once America, where only the broken and brutal can survive. One of the few to walk this horror frontier is Preacher Cain. Rumour has it that Cain was once a judge who succumbed to religion and madness in equal measure. Now he roams the godless territories, the physical embodiment of the angel of death. With his deputy Joe, a man Cain saved from the noose, they deliver divine retribution and punish sinners in a godless landscape. Created by Gordon Rennie and Frank Quitely for the Judge Dead magazine in 1993, Missionary Man immediately became an atmospheric and intense standout in no small part thanks to Quitely's simple yet distinctive early work and Rennie's defiantly lo-fi classical Western aesthetic indebted to the tobacco-chewing cinematic yarns of John Ford, Sam Peckinpah and Sergio Leone. Rennie blasts out his tale of Old Testament redemption, vengeance and cruel deliverance, soaked in idiosyncratic Scots piss and vinegar, while Frank quietly sharpshoots his way to comic stardom with artwork so precise and accurate, every exit wound, stubble chin and scorch plane feels so real you could fall right into the mayhem. From battling super mutants to taking on cursed earth cartels and even judges, as Kane's story unfolds, his past is revealed while he brings retribution and judgment to the dark corners of Dread's world, with a team including Simon Davis, Gary Marshall, Henry Flint and Alex Ronald taking over on art duties. The first part of this Western epic is contained in Missionary Man, Bad Moon Rising, available now in paperback and digital, while you have to dig out the magazines and progs between 1994 and 2002 for the rest. Well, thanks for joining us on the 2080 ABC Earthlets. Next week, we are off to the dark recesses of reality with the Necronauts. Mission Man.